So far, you've only been drawing gray colored shapes. Let's throw some color into these shapes to make them more interesting. Every shape has two elements that can be colored, a stroke and a fill. The stroke is the border of the shape. The fill is the color inside the shape. At any point, you can change the color used to draw the stroke or fill of the shape. For example, here we'll change the fill to be the color green before drawing a rectangle. If you draw more rectangles after setting the fill color, they'll also be green. Until you change the fill color, GameLab will continue to draw shapes in the color that you set. The same applies for the stroke of your shapes. If you don't want your shapes to have a stroke or a fill, you can use the no stroke or no fill commands to make it so. The order of commands matters a lot in GameLab. You need to change the color of your stroke or fill before you draw the shape. If you were drawing or painting in real life, this would be like dipping your paintbrush into your palette before drawing on the canvas. There's lots of other commands you can use to create interesting and complex drawings. As you get more familiar with all the drawing tools available in GameLab, you'll get better at bringing your ideas to life. Happy drawing!